Hello, hello, how are you? Hello, welcome to Read Aloud 2. We're going to read a story. It's called Alphabet. It's all about the letters of the alphabet. Letters A through what? B? No, not through B. Through M? No, through what? Through Z, that's right. So let's look and see what we can discover. What letter is that? A, 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 A. A is for Amanda. Her name is Amanda. And look, she's a good little teddy bear. She has a wagon of what's those? Apples. So apples begin with A and Amanda begins with A. And you know what? She takes these sweet apples everywhere she goes in her little wagon. What letter? B, 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 B. B is for Byron. Who snuggles in where? What is he in? In bed, that's right. Mom tucks him in with a kiss on the head. That's right. So Byron is B, begins with B, and bed begins with what? B. Good job. What letter is that? C. C is for Charles. What's the C sound? C, C, C. A stuffy old bear. He wears he wears a bow tie and a part in his hair. So Charles begin with the letter C. And look, it's, do you think it's hot outside or cold outside? It's snowing. That's right, it's cold outside and cold begins with the letter C. D is for Devin. Uh, D -D -D Devin, who's just like his pop. Their noses are big and their ears sort of flop. So look at D. This is Devin. He begins with the letter D, guys. Isn't that pretty cool? Devin, have you ever heard of somebody named Devin? I have a couple of friends named Devin. E is for Elsie, an exploring bear. He explores. E, Elsie, explore. All begins with the letter E. She went to the jungle because it was there. Look, what animals is that? The monkeys. What the monkeys begin with? The M. That's right. F is for Freddy. A big frightful mess. What he has been up to, no one can guess. Oh my goodness. Freddy is so dirty. What's the F sound? Good job. And frightful. Oh my goodness, what do you think he needs to do to get clean? That's right, friends, take a bath. G is for Gilbert. What does the G sound make? G, G, G. A gruff and a grizzly. So gruff and grizzly begin with G too. He's a gruff and grizzly bear. Whenever he growls, which begins with a G, you better beware. Oh my, let's hurry up and turn the page. H is for Henry. Henry, who loves his hot, hot begins with H, pancakes, uh-oh, with honey and butter like his mom likes to make, so he likes his hot pancakes like mom makes. I is for Evan, an itchy brown beer. He loves to be scratched from here then there. He likes to be scratched. Will you scratch the bear? Let's scratch it. Do you think you feel it? Mm, oh, no, guys. J is for John. Say J, J, John. Who loves jam and j jelly? It's easy to see. Just look at his belly. <laughs> so you can tell that he likes to eat jelly because he has a big old belly. K is for K K Kyle, a kite flying bear. He loves days that are breezy and fair. So he likes to fly his bear kite. Do you guys like to fly your kites when it's windy outside? I love kites too, guys. L O is for Laura. Who doesn't like lightning? Oh, she doesn't like it when it storms outside. Do you? I don't either. She thinks that the sound of thunder is pretty frightening. What letter comes next? M. What's the M sound? Mm, it's for Mark, a mysterious bear. Whenever you visit, you won't find him there because he is where? 
on the roof. Did you guys hear all those rhyming words? Where, there, and it's for Nikki. Nikki, that's just her nickname. Her real name is Minnie. Her mother's to blame. <laughs> so her real name is Nini, but they call her Nikki, which both begins with the letter M, right, guys? O is for what? Ollie, a one-year-old bear. He's just learned to walk, but can't kind of stare. Hmm, look at the bear on the stair who's learning how to walk. Look at him. He is for P -P Pam. Oh, uh oh, who loves a parade? She also likes popcorn and pink lemonade. So she likes a parade, popcorn, and pink lemonade. All begins with the P. -P, -P. Q is for Quimbley. Qu -qu Quimbley, a soft quilted bear. Who was sewn by him with much love and care? So bear care. Oh my goodness, you hear those rhyming words? Look at him. What is he doing? He's swinging on a swing. Have you ever seen a bear on a swing? Oh my goodness, friends. All right, it's for Robert. Robert, who thinks it that is great to sit by the fire? and read until it's late. So he likes to read stories. Do you guys like to read books? I hope you do. S is for what? Sarah, what's the S sounds? A snow-loving bear. Just give her a hat and warm mittens to wear. So bear and wear. So look, she likes to wear a hat, a scarf, mittens, and look, she dressed up the snowman too. T, 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 t is for Tammy, who wrinkles her nose. When you tickle her tummy, her chin, or her toes. So her tummy and toes and tickle begins with T like Tammy. T, t. U is for Ursula, a quite useless bear who seems to do nothing but sit in a stare. Oh my goodness. You, uh, uh, Ursula, just sits there and stares. Have you ever had those moments where you just sit there? It happens. V is for Vera. Vera, a great gentle vet. She lovingly takes care of anyone's pet. So vet and pet. They what? They rhyme. That's right. W is for William. W -w William, the great wonder bear. He wears a white cape and soars through the what? Through the air. Look at him. He's dressed in a cape. X, what's the X sound? It's for the way that this bear marks his place. So when he returns, he can find the same space. So place and space, they what? They rhyme. That's right. Y is for York. Yeah, yeah, York. Who's a young, young bear to sit at the table? He needs a what? A high chair. You see that, guys? Z is, what sound does a Z make? Z. Z is for Zach. Who says that it is true that zippers, zippers do better than buttons can do? From Amanda to Zach, the bears are at ease. Look at all the alphabet. Because now... They can say their A, B, C's. Did you guys like that story? That was a pretty cute story about the alphabet and all the little bears. All right, friends. Bye-bye. Have a great day.